to the dance, so I will show you this setup I came up with for collecting straw. As you can see, it works very, very well. Been trial and error. I have tried a lot of things, but this one's working absolutely perfect. It's just working and it can unload and everything by itself. The AI can unload it, can run by itself. Oh, as you can show, I can go out here and the AI is running it. Look at it. It's simply just perfect. I like it a lot. Just go like this. So let's take a look what you need to make this setup. Uh, we can take this. You don't need this. This is just so I can show you. There we go. Let's go to the other side. You need all of these things here. And these are all mods. Do I have two on? You don't need two of these. That's my mistake. Uh, have I one? This one. Okay, you only need one. Let's take a look at this. Okay, you need the Twister 600. I use that. You can also use another one. You need the forage pickups. It's a good one. Of course, you need the lizard runner. You need a front lift that goes in the back, and you need the TLX X52 tipper. That's one thing I will show you with the tipper you need to do before this is working. Uh, when you first see the tipper, you have. Let's take it to standard. Where is it? Lizard. There we go. You have all of these. I'll take this off. This is what it looks like standard. The first thing you need to configure if you want. I like big capacity because I have big fields and I don't have a lot of time. You need to make uh, this real or unreal your choice. One thing is not your choice is you need to have these tires on. The agricultural tires from Wetterstein. You need to have these on, otherwise this setup will not work. The other thing you also need to have rear hits. These are the only two things you need to have on this trailer. I already have those. Uh, once you have done that, you need to set a front lift. Once you have attached that to the trailer, if you try to drive forward, you can see the trailer will not move with you. You need to take the trailer off and on again for this to work. Go and on again. And now everything working as it should. Well, let's see if it still works as it should. There should be a little strip down here. The the reason why you need the front wind row, I can also show you that. Take the front wind row off. Then you cannot run this then the AI cannot run it. You cannot run this with AI if you want. If you wanna run this manually as a drive it yourself, perfect. Then you can do it. Uh, I need to get this started up. Please, thank you. There we go. 
So now you can see everything runs on the AI again. And once the trailer full, uh, the AI thinks it's only sorry about the mouse. It's only ring rowing. When the trailer is full, it will still keep on going, as you can see. Then you just need to stop it and to show you the AI working. I will deliver to the hail of this full yeah, let's just deliver to sell anything you don't need to you can deliver to what you want but I will deliver to sell anything for now I'll go and the AI is doing a thing as you can see the AI is driving it's not the best but it is still driving also deliver to your silo or to your production plant or whatnot so let's about see here so this back one is not an issue as you can see in a moment the AI is unloading just fine there we go there we go and I get a little money for that So no collision, no nothing, everything is just perfect. It works really, really well. 36,000, perfect. Yeah, that was all. And let's just take a look at it again. Perfect, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you another day. Bye.